Oh, good morning, weekenders. Um, believe it or not, it is a good morning. Yes, my throat hurts, but other than that, I feel fine. I just, it hurts to talk. So, I don't know how much talking we'll be doing today, but we are at the airport. I'm going to hop in the newly repainted Trum Bucket. And uh, this will be the second time flying it in like three months. So, uh, hopefully we do good. All right, change of plans, guys. We're taking the beaver. Sorry, Logan. Made it to Woodlake and the Beaver. Really uneventful. I think it's probably fair to say this is the first time an amphibious beaver has been to Woodlake. All right, we're back in Shafter. It means that we made it out of Woodlake pretty good also. We took off to the east, which is the opposite of what I usually do. The wind was pretty calm, but it was mainly to get away from the really big bumps over on the east side of the runway. And, uh, they worked out pretty good. I would definitely have no problem going back there in the beaver. I did try to uh, set up some cameras for the takeoff out of Wood Lake, but it didn't really work out because I completely forgot to. So, really sorry about that, guys. But um, yeah, on to the next activities, which probably involves a stop by Rite Aid. We got a bunch of dirt bikeaholics with us this weekend. We're going to race the hare and hound tomorrow. But most of them are from Louisiana and they said, hey, we need to go do some pre-riding before the race. So we're out at Hart Park, got a bunch of dirt bikes, a rip.
<laughs> All right, guys. We uh, went and ate lunch slash dinner. Then uh, went over to the airport. Just did a quick lap around the pattern in the chum bucket, pretty much. Came back over here. Rode the free rides just at the house. Now it's dark. I'm going to bed. Gotta wake up early. Hoping my voice is better in the morning, guys, but I don't think it's gonna be. See you then. Well, good morning, weekenders. My throat is <clears throat> a little bit better. Not uh, 100% by any means. Still dark morning, I would call this. We're off to the races. up we made it to the track and get inside I just beefed it. Uh, really bad. Oh, I'm feeling it, guys. Let's see what happens. Try to finish up this first week. Okay, weekenders, I'm dead. That crash took a lot out of me. My whole left side hurts pretty, really bad. My head is uh, not right. I hit that thing pretty hard. Not to mention this sinus infection I got going on. I made it to uh, mile 58, about halfway through the second loop. And then I saw a little uh, worker guy. He said that uh, the hard stuff was just getting started and I said, there's no way I'm doing it. I was struggling already. So I decided to come on back in. I may be a quitter, guys. Uh, I, as you may know, I am in the running for the championship. My main competition also DNF'd, so that's the only good news I got for you. All right, guys, done with the race. Uh, I did an interview <clears throat> after the first loop, uh, trying to get a quick pit stop so I could uh, stay in the race. 
My uh, second loop, terrible. Got stuck on a hill climb. Uh, got kind of bloodied up, broke my arm, healed again, so I'm okay. Uh, overall, second loop was tough. I was tired, but uh, I gotta say, this was a tough race, but 10 out of 10 for the hair now, guys. See you at the next one. <laughs> I made it back to Shafter. I got a bad limp, a broken voice, and uh, that's pretty much going to be it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I kind of enjoyed living it. See you next time. Croissant! <laughs>